One of the most common questions we get asked almost on a daily basis is, do I need my Cert for or diploma to go for my builder's license? Now, the short answer is no. Hi, and welcome to our industry update on the 3rd of October, 2022. We had a really big week at builder registration, probably record numbers, we've got 20 registrations. And of the 20, we had 14 domestic registrations, five commercial, and one license down in Tassie. So congratulations to everyone that got registered, and thank you for choosing builder registration as your industry partner. Now, last week, we spoke a lot about the 331 process of getting your builder's license. Today, I want to focus specifically on the commercial low rise. That's where you can build up to 15 meters tall and one level basement in the ground. The three up and one down are license we used to call it. Now, something that the VBA have always asked for, but they haven't really enforced is having basement experience in your three profiles. Now, when you look at your three profile jobs, if none of them had a basement and they had significant enough history they would be able to issue the low rise license but in the last six to nine months they've really tightened that up and it's become very strict that if you don't have a basement job they will not issue you even a, the opportunity to test for the license they straight decline it from the application standpoint what we're doing is really um revolutionary is that we're trying to pilot some guys in the country victoria and specifically geelong and shepparton who unfortunately in country they just don't do basements and they've got no chance of getting that basement experience so we're piloting these guys through the VBA to give them the best chance, putting a lot of effort in their cover letter and story and make sure they've got a 10 out of 10 application going into the VBA because they are fantastic candidates and we're trying to pilot them through to see if they can get through to get that license because at the moment it's really tough for anyone in the rural area. So if anyone in the rural area or are unable to get that basement experience or exposure to those sorts of job sites, reach out and let us know. We'd love to see if we can help you out and get you through to get that license. So if you are in the area and you can't tick that box for basement experience, just reach out and let us know and we'll see if we can help you out. One of the most common questions we get asked almost on a daily basis is, do I need my Cert for or diploma to go for my builder's license? Now, the short answer is no. On the VBA website, it does say that that is one of the prescribed qualifications. And if you see any letters from the VBA where someone's been declined, it will always mention that you do not have a diploma as one of the reasons. However, as you guys know from listening to these videos, we get five to 15 licenses every week, and we got 20 this week, which is pretty exciting. Um, but we know specifically that if you have a strong history and a good reference running the 331 that we spoke about last week, we can achieve your builder's license without a cert form or diploma. So thanks for joining us on another weekly industry update. We're sending a final shout out that our last course in Frankston is Thursday this week. So if that is appealing to you or anyone you know, please contact us by tomorrow in order to get, we've got uh, four spots left for that course. So reach out, let us know, and um, hopefully it's something you can jump on. Um, and finally, with the VBA, they're currently interviewing applications submitted in April. So if you've submitted in May, June, July, there is still a bit of a wait, but right now they're conducting interviews for people that have submitted in April. Thanks for joining us. We look forward to seeing you next week. Thank you.